Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypt of the Necrodancer. Let's begin again with zone number two. I've got my first taste of the boss, let's hope this time I can actually defeat it. Okay, not so bad so far. What is that? I have no idea what that is. Whoa, deafened. Oh, deafens, you can't hear the beat. That would make it very hard. <laughs> that's an interesting enemy. Whoa, that's a whole conga line of skeletons. Let's wait for them to come around the corner. Oh. I was that low on hearts? Oh my god. If I just stayed there, I could have kept killing them as they came around the corner. I shouldn't have moved. Whoops. Weapon, weapon, weapon? Ah, dagger. No, well, it's a better weapon, but it's just a dagger. I prefer the long range. Of anything. Any any weapon with a long range is much better than a dagger. That is an explosive mushroom. Let's not hit that. You can hit it once, and if you don't kill it, you can get away from it. Okay, good to know. I thought it just exploded instantly. Whoa, that's dangerous. There we go. Look for some secrets in the walls. Come back here. I don't know why I moved towards it. Ah, yes, a spear and an apple. Let's grab this too. I think the song is about to end. Can I make it? Nope. Down we go. Freaking pile of loot in the wall. Look at this. Ah, oh, right, I can't dig through that.
That is a big version of me. Bloody spear. Purple scroll. Can't remember what that does if I've ever even tested it. spell. Actually, I should probably use that right now. Yeah. Wait, what? Th that's all it does? Oh, but I can refresh it. Okay. After 20 somethings, it refreshes. Is that 20 enemies? Potion. I have no idea what that does. Looks like the potion automatically healed me when I got down to the point where I would die, perhaps? Oh god, this is a whole lot of trouble. Okay, this is a problem. This is a big problem. Let's try this. The oh, the song ended anyway. D oh, d I just wasted my spell then. I used it for like one beat. Damn it. Oh god, that's a dragon. Oh yes, that's a dragon. Oh, I couldn't... Uh. <laughs> I couldn't move down. Could I have moved up? Let's see what happened. God, the pace is so fast, it's hard to think that fast. Yeah, I guess I could have moved up. I yeah, I think I could have. Yeah, no, I could have moved up. Oh, that was a pretty good run, though. I got eight, eight diamonds. Let's see. Are those like knee pads? What are those? I think eight is enough to. Yeah, I could afford that. Get a bigger coin multiplier, but I really don't need coin. Like, I'm seriously not even close to running out of coin. I feel like I need more armor. So let's go with armor. Ah, they're Greaves. Okay. Hold on, how much damage did that thing do to me? Let's look at the hearts. Two hearts of damage! Oh my god. 
Holy crap. You really, really, really need armor. Wait, I've got four. Four diamonds. I actually think I can, I think I can buy something. Hello. Shovel. Hmm. I have not actually been getting a lot of, like, pickaxes or shovels or anything like that. Let's see what else there is. Yeah, let's go with the shovel. Oh yeah, and as someone said, apparently the obsidian... I think it's the obsidian... Uh, the obsidian equipment, equipment, the effectiveness of it actually scales with your coin multiplier. So if your multiplier is high, you do more damage with a weapon, for example. And if it's low, you do less damage. And I think that was an obsidian shovel, so I'm assuming it would behave the same way. Where if your coin multiplier is at the minimum, you can probably only dig through dirt. But if it gets higher, you can probably dig through the stone and stuff. So, interesting. So different drawbacks to different kinds of uh, weapons. As far as I can tell, Titanium is just straight up better than the basic weapon, but, you know, Obsidian depends on your coin multiplier. Glass, I think, is very effective, but if you take too much damage, it breaks. So, some trade-offs. Preemptively grab the apple. Let's grab this too, it's super cheap. Plenty of healing now. I can afford the broadsword now. Damn it. I don't know why I did that. Let's go ahead and use the heal spell because I think it only heals one up and right. Oh, it only heals a half a heart. Actually, I don't want to let the armadillo out. Let's go try to get the broadsword. If I can reach it in time, which I probably can't. I don't even remember where the shop was. It's on the map. It's very far away. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. Because I think the song is about to end. Yep, here we go. <laughs> not even close. I still have the basic weapon. That is very sad. Hey, diamonds. Please give me a weapon. Ah. <sighs> I think that's the fireball, yeah. The red scroll. Ooh, shop. Yes, okay. Let's grab... Hell, let's grab everything. That's the longsword, right? Titanium longsword, sweet. Red torch, and a shovel. Now I can dig through this stuff. Drop it. 
drumstick. This run suddenly got very, very good. <laughs> Armadillo just <laughs> fell down to the next level. Smooth one. Okay, where else? Left and down. the hell just happened? Uh, left or right? There we go. I just really, really messed up. I lost the beat completely. There we go. Uh, you can go up there. I don't really care to chase you. Oh, why did I step on that? Jesus, what am I doing? Uh, up and right, there we go. Wow, this run suddenly got very bad. Um, I kind of need armor, too. Jesus. Wow, I really messed up there. Jesus. Let me get the beat down. Okay. Armor, yes. Sweet. Use the heal. Oh god. Oh, why did I fucking st ah, I keep doing that. There we go, thank god. Jesus. <laughs> that little mole thing can't get out of there, it's stuck. In the upright position. It's freaking out! Or maybe it's just, uh, blocking that black skeleton. Oh... Even with the chainmail? How much health did I have? Oh, I only had one. <laughs> I only had one. I only had one heart. God damn it. Man, your runs can go south so fast. That was going brilliantly, and then I completely fucked up and lost, like, all my health. Ah, but, you know what? There's usually a good side to it. In this case, I have ten diamonds. Hi. I'm going with more armor, like, I really want armor. Heavy plate, excellent. Hmm, torch? Yeah, let's go with the torch.
Oh god. I don't know why I did that. That was dumb. I do not want to be here. Let's wait for it to get out of the sludge. <laughs> wow! <sighs> See if I can buy something for four. Get a ring. I think all the stuff to the left is going to cost too much. Yeah. I can't even afford a hunk of meat. A ring it is. Ring of Might. I wonder what that actually does. I need a key? I guess I probably get it from the shop. Oh, there's the Ring of Might. Question is, what does it do? I think it actually maybe increased my damage? I think that might have increased my damage by one. Which is actually really, really good. Oh, there's the key! Oh god. Oh, damn it! Why did I go sideways? Fuck! There better be something really good in this chest. That's pretty good. Yeah, it does increase my damage by one. That's what the Ring of Might does. Okay, cool. Yeah, that is excellent. Why is there a door when there's... it doesn't even block off a room? <laughs> Very bad architect designed this dungeon. And we're about to go down. I'm just gonna go down myself. Alright, the compass is pointing to something. I don't know if I ever figured out what it's pointing to. The shop? The stairs? Oh my god, what the... It did two hearts of damage. It did two hearts of damage. Give me armor! Hey. Hello. That's one hell of a cheap ring. Well, I guess I'll get that and the scroll. Ring of Courage. Great, start out with a dragon, coming towards me. Okay, where are you? You are working your way through here. Oh my god. <laughs> They're easy to fight if you can get in sync with them and have a very, very large vertical space to move, but if you don't, you're screwed.
diamonds. something. Is it above me? Sounds like it's above me. Hmm. Okay, what does the purple do? Oh, gigantism, okay. <laughs> I love the way I stomp everywhere. I don't like the way I lose my multiplier, though. Oh, I lost it. That didn't even work. I'm actually doing really, really bad. I'm almost dead. Let's see what I can buy. Got a bunch of coin. I think I should buy everything. And I think we're about to go down. Yep, we are. Okay. The whip. Not my favorite weapon. It's got a long vertical, a uh, long, like, horizontal strip range next to you. Oh god, dragon. Never. Oh god, dragon. Dragon, dragon, dragon. Is it red? It is red. Okay. Oh, oh thank god. I do enough damage that it's uh, not that big of a deal. Okay. Heal. Nice. Okay. We're going places. I think that sludge monster just, like, gripped me and kept me there. This whip is really hard to get get a hold of. It it attacks in such a weird way. It's like a three or four or maybe even five horizontal strip in front of your character, so it doesn't have a long reach forwards, but it has a long reach sideways. It's really, really weird, so I can do this sideways, but if it was in front of me two spaces, it wouldn't work. I wonder if that's a secret room. If I had a super good shovel. Or maybe that just goes into the shop from the back. Sometimes I notice something like a millisecond after I make the move, where it's like I know I'm about to die and I know I just pressed it, and there's nothing I can do about it. Uh... I can't even afford a single thing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh god. I'm just getting the hell out of here. Okay, bomb is down left. Whew. I messed up and totally lost the beat, but I actually killed it, so that's something. I'm very close to death. Let's see if I can find some cheese or a drumstick. Nope. No such luck. I'm not even gonna attack those. They're too clustered. Not worth it. Titanium dagger. Uh, versus Blood Dagger? I, I think Blood Dagger maybe gives me health, I'm not actually sure. I'm gonna stick with the Blood Dagger. Ooh, I see you. Charisma versus Ring of Gold. I don't need gold, so I'm gonna go with Ring of Charisma. Can I dig my way into the... I think, maybe the shops are hidden. Is that how it works? Like in later levels, the shops are hidden and you need uh, some sort of a device to break through the wall to get to it? Maybe that's how it works. Wait, the Blood Dagger only does one point of damage, doesn't it? Okay, never mind, I should have taken the Titanium one. Crap. Okay, well I don't have enough diamonds to actually afford something. Oh, damn it! Ugh. I thought I had more time than that. Fuck! Okay, well I could buy something. Let's get some food, I need health. Going full ham. I feel like I almost never get armor or healing items lately. I don't know what it is. This is not a good situation. I'm just gonna restart. <laughs> that is not a good situation. Damn it! Oh. I, I just can't fight those clones of myself, like, I just don't even know how. Well, 
I did it accidentally there. Didn't expect what the hell? I didn't even know it could do that. I thought it was safe. <laughs> I'm gonna be chasing this for a long time. Let's get it to go a different way, shall we? Like, how about here? No, it's gonna end before I get to the shop. I don't, I don't know what yellow scroll. I didn't want to buy that. Damn it! I don't even know what that does. I can't even remember what that does. What does that do? Um, up and left. Oh, it gives me money. Oh, that's right. Yellow, gold. Okay. Okay. I need to buy stuff. Like I need to buy everything. Armor. Oh, spear. Yes. Thank God, although I only have one heart, so I'm going to die very, very, very quickly. This is very, very dangerous. I don't like this place. I'm just going to avoid it. The purple mushroom in particular, I think, would take two hits to kill. And it does a lot of damage. Okay, where can I go? Looking at the mini-map. Let's go up here. Okay, there's like nothing up here. Let's see if I can bust through the wall. There we go. Escaped. Around the mushroom things. I mentioned I love the spear. <laughs> See if I can find some secrets in the walls or something. Ooh, chest. Can I attack it from here? Yes. There we go. Alright, see if I can get... Nope, not gonna be able to get there. Oh, well, that's fine. Doing pretty good on everything but health. I'm doing very, very bad on health. And if I hear a dragon stomping around, I'm dead. Crap. This thing can't pierce the shield. Oh, god damn it! <laughs> I was trying to get on the side of it. Fuck! Yeah, so um, how it seems to work with the shield things, whether you can knock the shield off or not, seems to depend on the strength of your weapon. It's not the sort of thing where it's as if the shield has hit points of its own, and if you keep hitting it, it'll fall off. It seems to be either you can defeat it in one hit, if your weapon is strong enough, or if it's too weak, you can't uh, knock the shield off at all. So, yeah.
as well. Hmm. Shovel. I have have had very few shovels, so let's go with the shovel. God, I haven't even gotten to the boss again. That depresses me. I don't remember if I tested that. Let's give it a shot. What what does that do? I don't know what that does. If I keep doing it, it turns white after a while. I don't know what that does. What is that doing? Temporarily increases my damage, perhaps? Ooh, I think it did. I should have moved. Damn it. Whatever. I I'm going to restart, but uh, I want to test this thing out. I think it temporarily boosts my damage. I, ah! I didn't even get to test it out properly. God. What the... Yeah, I think it temporarily boosts your damage. Interesting, but it's really, really, really tricky to use. But actually, it could be very useful, because there's a lot of times where you want to stay put, because if you move forwards, you'll move into the enemy's... Uh, in range of the enemy's attack. And so instead of moving forwards into the enemy's attack, you move backwards, which then puts you too far away, and then you have to move forwards again, and then attack. But if you use the war drum, you can stay in place. Which actually could be very useful. back to the store when I have more money. The teal scroll makes you descend! <laughs> Wonderful, that's exactly what I wanted. Okay, well at least the shop is right here. Okay, I, I just need a new weapon, like, I can't go around with a stupid dagger. I'm not getting near that mushroom, no way. That's a pit of death. Armor? Sweet. Oh, god damn it, fuck. I was I was moving as if I had the dagger still. Because I, 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 I would have moved towards it and then attacked it, but instead I attacked it twice because of the extended range, damn it. Hmm. 
It's a lot going on here. Okay. go, a little bit of health. I should go spend my money. Better shovel. I think so cheap, why not? So I think I can, yeah, I can go through that stuff now. Sweet. Can I make it? Can I make it? Doesn't even matter. My, yeah, my coin, coin let's try that again. My coin multiplier is already uh, at the lowest it can be. Do. Oh, it just moves you in whatever direction you happen to move towards it. Gotcha. Four hundred for that armor? Oh my god. Could I get enough coins down here to get that? Almost certainly not. Almost certainly not. No way. Food is more important. Might have wasted some of that food, actually. Magic torch. It's a busy place. No, they're, they're spraying too fast. I can't. I can't go in there. That thing is huge! Oh my god, why is it so big? Purple, 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 purple does... I, I can never remember what they do. I know the yellow one gives you gold, but that's about it. And teal makes you go to a lower level. Shit. No, I'm, I'm not getting near him. I'm gonna try the purple thing. Okay, that's what it does. I kind of want to just leave. Whoa, look at that, holy crap! Full on Minecraft, look at this. Oh, it's gone, damn it. Look at my coins, I think, whoa, okay. Is this the boss? This is the boss, isn't it? Did there really have to be enemies here right in front of the boss? Oh my god. I'm facing the boss with a half a heart. Again. Again. And I have a broadsword, which is like one of the worst weapons for this. Oh no. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Killed my death metal in like half a second. Okay. That is not surprising.
Well, now that I know there's armor that costs 400, I think... I'm gonna get this. Yeah, now my basic multiplier is two. Excellent. Alright, one more decent run for the night. Or, well, actually it's not nighttime for me. It might be nighttime for you, but I guess... One more decent run for the... the day. There we go. The day. Pickaxe, sweet. Usually I don't get something like that this early. Oh god. If I get hit by that twice, I'm dead. Oh, uh, wow. I just went back to get my thing. That did not go too well, but it didn't go horribly. When in the middle of a fight, do not pick up your pickaxe. I can't even get past that armadillo. Unless I dig through the wall. There we go. Yes, my lovely spear. Just a basic spear, though, is now very poor in terms of damage for these tiers of uh, enemies. Get to the diamonds. All I did was take damage instead of getting them, though. God damn it. I actually got through the first level without getting any diamonds. That is sad. Oh boy. Nobody can get in here, though. Uh, never mind. How the hell did you get in here? This is not a good situation to be in. My spear is too weak.
Ooh. Yes. Plate armor seems pretty good. Ooh, this one's marked. Hold on. Ah! Oh, ooh. Sacrifice hearts for a weapon? Or for whatever. Two hearts? No way. No. That is not worth it. Or is it? You know what? What the hell? Let's give it a shot. Let's go with this. Golden bow. I've never used a bow before. Let's see what this does. Alright, I'm, I'm guessing it's super long range forwards and nowhere else. So let's give this a shot. Yeah, okay. How much damage does it do, though? <laughs> I can just keep doing this all day. Okay, so I think it maybe only does one point of damage. Maybe two, because they can't get through that shield. Yeah, it only does one. Okay. Low damage. Very high range. Interesting. Interesting. So, it's going to take a long time to kill stuff, but you can do it from a very safe distance. That is sweet. Just what I need. Thank you. Ooh, Rapier. Titanium. Hmm. You, you know, I want to try this. I mean, I paid two hearts for it. I think it's going to be very useful, even though it is quite weak. Yeah. Let's stick with it. I mean, look at this. You can really keep your distance. Oh, shit! Titanium Spear. Oh, God, there's a Titanium Spear! <sighs> It's making it harder and harder to keep the bow, but I paid for it. I'm going to get some money out of it. I'm going to get some use out of it. Because range really is everything. Look at this. That is beautiful. Should probably just go down, I suppose. Let's see, where else can I go? trying to look at the mini-map, but it's hard to look at the mini-map. I've already lost my multiplier. Whatever, I'll stay put. Okay, let's go up here. Oh, I need health. I really need health. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I might be able to do this. I mean, I have super, super long range. And I have decent armor. What I'm really low on is health, but I do also have a fireball. A spell. Up and left. Okay. I think I can do this. I mean, all I have to do is stay really far away. Which shouldn't be a problem. Yes. Yes, I did it. That bow was totally worth it. It does low damage, very low damage, but the distance makes all the difference. Yes, the pile of loot is mine! What is it gonna give me? <gasps> five diamonds? Wait, that was more than five. That had to be more than five, right? It looks like it said plus five, but I'm pretty sure it gave me like ten. I finally did it! Zone two boss is down! Boom! That is very, very satisfying. Zone 3 unlocked. I can only imagine the horrors that await me there. I love the bow now. 
the flail. Okay, nothing new here. Okay, so flail is nine, so that would leave me with seven to spend. Okay, yeah, let's just get the most diamond efficient thing, which is this ring of war. And this. Sweet. Well, I will save exploration of zone number three for the next episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.